What's up everyone, it's Dono. This week I got a question about what's the best way to stay on topic. And before I jump into that, I just wanna let you know that, you know, rap is, is pretty close to poetry and you don't have to always stick to a really tight topic. If you listen to a lot of songs, people jump around a lot and stuff like that. So it's not really a big deal if your ideas are kind of all over the place, especially when you start throwing in a lot of figurative language like similes, metaphors, um, you may really expand the original subject that you started talking about. So don't get too discouraged if if you're jumping around a little bit. Sometimes it's nice to just express what it is that you're feeling and get that out. Now, that being said, there are a few ways that you can really stick a little bit closer to your topic. So let me give you a couple ideas for how to do that. The first thing that you can do that will really help you stay on topic is to write an outline of the song or verse that you're going to do. And if it's a song, you're gonna to wanna to map out, you know, roughly how many bars there are in the song so you know how much space you have to cover your topic. Now, when you write an outline, it makes it a lot easier to stay on topic because if you start writing something that doesn't fit or isn't quite right, you look back at your outline and go, well, uh, you know, that's not gonna work. So you'll have to edit it to hit your outline. Not to mention your brain will just naturally be more ready to write the things that you've already thought about. When you write an outline, it doesn't have to be, you know, like really specific, like outline every single line that you're gonna write, but just put some ideas out there, like verse one, I'm gonna cover this. Verse two, I'm gonna cover this. Verse three, we move into this. And, and that way you just have a, a guiding line to help you while you write your lines. Now, if that's a little bit too structured for you, you can also just pick a theme and as you write each line, make sure to look back at your theme and make sure that you're sticking to that theme. So every single line that you write, you think about, okay, I wrote this, does this make sense with the theme I want? That way, you know, you're never really getting off topic because that theme is so present in your mind. And once you get done with what you've written, you can always look back at your theme and look back at your lines and see how they connect. And if there's any that don't fit what you were going for, edit those out. It doesn't hurt you to you know, edit your work. You don't have to always go with the first draft. So you're more than welcome to change up the lines to make them fit better if you want to stay on topic more. Another thing that you can do to make your lines connect a little bit better is to write line by line and refer to the last line that you've used when you write your next line. So I don't necessarily mean that you have to say every single thing over and over and over again. It's just more that you know you write line one, then you pay attention to that line to write the next one. Then you make sure that the third line chains in from what you've written in the second line and continue so on and so forth. You might jump around a lot of topics, which is totally okay this way you're just going to have smoother transitions because you've paid really close attention to how each line fits with the rest. Another thing to keep in mind is that a lot of songs change topics a little bit when you switch verses. So that's really not a big deal. Uh, again, you, you have the flexibility to kind of talk about whatever subject you want, however you want. But if your goal is really smooth transitions and really coherent topics, then you're gonna want to adopt one of these strategies or come up with your own to make sure that each topic transition comes out smoothly and you're expressing the ideas that you want to. It also is gonna help the audience pay better attention when it's a coherent topic. If it just keeps switching all over the place, it might be a little bit harder for them mentally to keep up with where you're going. Those are really the best ways that I know that you can you know, have a little bit more coherency and a little bit more solidarity in your topic choice. But again, don't feel like you have to you know, make everything connect really perfectly and smoothly. It is art, you do have the ability to you know, let things be a little bit more loose. But if that's what you wanna to do to you know, help your listeners out, help them connect a little bit better, those are some great strategies to do it. And that is really all I've got for this video. As always, don't forget to check out my music promotion site, noteis.us. I've also got a t-shirt store, Snap Merch. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, anything you want me to cover, blah, 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 
put it down in the comment box and I will get to it as soon as possible. It really helps me out when you guys ask questions because it makes it really easy to think of topics that you want covered. So please, please keep asking. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe so you can stay up to date on the videos. And if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, put them down in the comment box and I'll get to them as quick as possible. See you guys.